Hey guys, Maniac here with GameAccess.net with a special unboxing right here. This is the Zone of Enders HD Collection on the PS3. Just picked this up with Twitch. He got the copy of it for himself on the Xbox 360. This includes Zone of Enders and Zone of Enders the Second Runner which were released originally on the PlayStation 2. I chose the PlayStation 3 version because of the pedigree. This was done by the Kojima team. You can see right here. And published by Konami. And as you can see right here in big bold letters, anyone who picks this up gets access to Metal Gear Rising Revengeance Demo Early Access. Now this is only being made available um, on the PS3 and the Xbox 360. And the demo is only coming to those platforms. In the United States, I'm fairly certain Metal Gear Solid Revengeance, I'm sorry, Metal Gear Re Rising Revengeance is coming um, to the Xbox 360 and the PlayStation 3 next year. It is not coming to the Xbox 360 in Japan, however. At least it's easy to open. Now, I was first made aware of the Zone of Enders system when the first Zone of Enders game came out shortly before the release of Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of the Patriots. In fact, actually, Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of the Patriots actually was had a demo included with the original Zone of Enders game. So, ten years later, History is repeating itself because you've got another Metal Gear game that's being included that a lot of people are anticipating with this. So let's crack this open and take a look inside. And this will include a whole bunch of new cinematics as well as a whole bunch of, um, sorry. That's a cool looking disc actually. There's the Metal Gear demo on the disc. It's possible. Thought it would be like a code or something. No, if it is included, I'll certainly do a play of that later. I thought there was going to be like a download code or something. If it's on the disc physically. Yeah, I think it's on the disc. Here's the manual. I like the nice graphics. There are some new stuff included. I uh, like some new cutscenes and things like that. It's pretty cool. And I don't see any download codes, so my guess is it must be on the disc. Or it must be coming towards the disc or whatever. Yeah. Technical specifications list uh, 720p, although it does say uh, 1080i and 1080p output back here. Sometimes that's wrong. It says it requires about 9 megabytes of hard drive space, which is a lot less than Silent Hill HD collection required. It required about 3.5 gigs. Uh, yeah. I can't wait to play this, and I can't wait to play the Zone of Enders. I'm sorry, the Zone of Enders, and I can't wait to play the Mega Rising Revengeance uh, demo. So I'm really looking forward to this. That's what's it. It looks like the, it's going to be on the disc. Like all the game content is going to be on the disc. So that's awesome. If you're a Zone of Enders fan, definitely pick this up. It's $40 US. If you are a fan of the Metal Gear games and other games that Kojima Team did, definitely pick this up as well. If you did not pick up Zone of Enders when you had the opportunity to back when it came out, I recommend this. I mean, I haven't played Zone of Enders, but I've been really excited to hear more about it. And I'm really happy that Kojima team decided to re-release this series because, you know, now I have finally have a chance to play it. Um, next up, Kojima team, if you're going to re-release something, re-release Snatcher and Police Knots. Doesn't matter to which. In fact, the iPhone would probably work best for those games. So uh, get, get to that. Um, and, of course, continue making your fantastic games like Metal Gear Rising Revengeance and Metal Gear Solid Ground Zeroes. So, um, back to work, Konami. I uh, can't wait to play this. Take care. Maniac out.